Have you ever wondered if the advice you're getting from your local pet shop is truly trustworthy? It's a question that rings in the minds of many pet owners and enthusiasts. Indeed, these hubs of pet paraphernalia are often our first port of call when seeking guidance on how to care for our beloved critters. But just how reliable is the counsel we receive from behind the counter? Let's dive a little deeper. Pet shops at their core are commercial entities. Their primary objective, like any business, is to generate profit. This is not to say that they don't care about the welfare of the animals they sell. Quite the contrary. However, it does mean that their advice might sometimes be skewed towards selling you more products rather than what's necessarily best for your pet. Moreover, while many pet shop employees are undoubtedly animal lovers, their expertise can vary significantly. Some may possess a wealth of knowledge and experience, while others may be relatively new to the field or simply misinformed. This inconsistency can lead to the propagation of inaccurate or even harmful advice. Further complicating matters is the sheer diversity of pets and their respective needs. From dogs and cats to birds, fish and reptiles, each species requires specific care. It's unrealistic to expect every pet shop worker to be an expert in all areas. As such, the advice you receive might be a generic one-size-fits-all solution rather than tailored to your pet's unique requirements. So with this in mind, it's clear that it's not always wise to take pet shop advice at face value. It's crucial to approach such guidance with a healthy dose of skepticism, supplementing it with your own research and consultation with reliable sources. After all, when it comes to the welfare of our furry, feathered or scaled friends, we want to ensure we're doing the very best we can. But worry not, there is a solution to this dilemma, doing your own research. Now you may be wondering, why is it so crucial to conduct independent research? Well, my friends, the answer lies in the heart of informed decision-making. When it comes to caring for our pets, whether they have fur, feathers or fins, it's essential to be as knowledgeable as possible. After all, they rely on us for their well-being. You see, when you take the time to learn about your pet's needs, you're not just becoming a better pet parent, you're also becoming a savvy consumer. You'll be able to spot questionable advice, recognize quality products, and make decisions that truly benefit your pet's health and happiness. Imagine walking into a pet shop armed with your own research. You'll be able to ask the right questions, challenge the sales pitches, and select the best products for your pet's needs. It's like having a secret weapon that ensures you're always making the best choices for your pet. But here's the thing. Independent research isn't just about debunking pet shop myths. It's about cultivating a deeper understanding of your pet. It's about knowing what signs of illness to look out for, understanding their dietary needs and learning how to create an environment that makes them thrive. And the best part? This knowledge empowers you to take control of your pet's well-being. No longer do you have to rely solely on the advice of pet shop employees. Instead, you become the expert the one who knows what's best for your pet. In this vast universe of information, you have the ability to sift through the noise, to find the truth, and to use that truth to provide the best care possible for your pet. So, don't shy away from doing your own research. Embrace it, seek it out, let it guide your decisions and shape your journey as a pet parent. Remember, knowledge is power, especially when it comes to the well-being of your beloved pets. But where do you start your research, you ask? Well, finding reliable sources is key. To begin with, the internet is a treasure trove of information, but not all that glitters is gold. Look for reputable websites that specialize in pet care, particularly those focused on fish keeping. Websites like these often have a wealth of articles, guides and FAQs that can help answer your queries and guide your decisions. Don't shy away from books either. While they might seem a bit old school in the digital age, they often contain in-depth information that can be quite enlightening. Look for books authored by experts in the field, those who've spent years studying and understanding the nuances of aquatic life. Forums can be a great place to gather practical advice. These are communities where fish keepers, both novices and veterans, share their experiences, tips and tricks. But remember, while forums can offer a lot of useful insights, they are also platforms where anyone can share their opinions. 
so it's crucial to cross-verify information gleaned from forums with other reliable sources. Now here's an important point to remember. Always lean towards sources that are backed by scientific research. Science is our best tool for understanding the world around us, including the intricate ecosystem of a fish tank. So, when a source cites scientific studies or research, it's usually a good sign that the information is reliable. Podcasts and webinars can also be a good source of information. These platforms often invite experts to discuss various topics and can provide a wealth of knowledge. Just make sure the experts are indeed experts and not just self-proclaimed gurus. Finally, don't forget about your local library. Libraries often have a section dedicated to pet care and can be a great place to find books and magazines on the subject. Plus, it's always nice to support your local library. In conclusion, when it comes to finding reliable sources of information, it's about quality over quantity. So, ensure you're using reliable sources to gather accurate, trustworthy information. Now, let's talk about building your knowledge on pet care. You see, the beauty of being a pet owner isn't just in the companionship and joy that these lovely creatures bring. It's also in the journey of learning and growing as a caregiver. Building your knowledge is a continuous process and one that comes with immense rewards. As you start diving deeper into the world of pet care, you'll uncover a multitude of fascinating facts and information. For instance, did you know that goldfish actually have a memory span of three months, contrary to the common myth of a three-second memory? Or that better fish are capable of recognizing their human caretakers? It's these little nuggets of knowledge that not only enrich your understanding, but also help you provide better care for your pet. Now, how do you go about building this knowledge? Well, it's quite simple. Start with the basics. Learn about your pet's diet, habitat and behaviour. Read books, watch documentaries, listen to podcasts and join online forums. Engage with other pet owners and enthusiasts. Ask questions, share experiences and learn from each other. Next, delve into the more specific aspects of pet care. If you own a fish, for example, learn about tank maintenance, water parameters and disease prevention. Understand the different types of fish food and their nutritional benefits. Get to grips with the signs of common health issues and their treatments. Remember, the more you learn, the more empowered you become. With knowledge comes confidence. You'll be able to make informed decisions, debunk myths, and even guide other pet owners. You'll know when to trust the advice given in pet shops and when to question it. And most importantly, you'll be able to provide the best possible care for your beloved pet. After all, they're not just pets, they're family. They depend on us for their well-being, and it's our responsibility to ensure they lead a healthy and happy life. Becoming an informed pet owner ensures both your confidence and your pet's well-being. And that, my friends, is the true joy of being a pet owner. Finally, remember to trust your instincts. It's a phrase we've all heard, but when it comes to caring for your pets, and specifically your aquatic friends, it holds more weight than you might think. You see, instincts are a powerful tool. They are deeply ingrained within us, guiding us towards decisions that often prove to be in our best interests. And when it comes to pet care, they can serve as a lifesaver, quite literally. As you navigate the world of pet shops and fish stores, armed with your research and newfound knowledge, you'll start to develop a keen sense of what feels right and what doesn't. You'll find that the advice you receive from pet shop employees might not always align with your understanding or your observations. And that's when you need to trust your instincts. Let's say, for instance, you notice that your fish seem more active and vibrant when you feed them a particular brand of food. But a pet shop worker insists that another more expensive brand is better. You've done your research and both brands seem to have similar nutritional content. So what do you do? Trust your observations. Trust your instincts. Your instincts are built on a solid foundation of personal observation and experience. Two things that no pet shop advice can ever replace. Your connection with your pets, your understanding of their behaviours, their likes and dislikes. These are all things that you, and only you, can truly understand. So, when your instincts tell you something, listen. Don't be afraid to question the advice you receive if it contradicts what you believe to be true. After all, you are the one who spends the most time with your pets. You are the one who knows them best. In the end, it comes down to this. 
Pet shops can provide valuable advice, but they don't have the final say. You do. So be a critical thinker, trust your instincts, and make the best decisions for your pets. In conclusion, while pet shops can be a convenient source of advice, they should not be your only source. It's essential to independently research, make use of reliable and scientifically backed sources, and continually build on your knowledge base. Always trust your instincts when it comes to the welfare of your finned friends. Remember, you have the power to make informed decisions for your pets. So do your research and trust your judgment. Your pets are counting on you.